the EDL and their activities. And it's going to tell you why. Ash. Thank you very much, uh, Mukhtar Ali Sahib. Thank you very much. Brothers and sisters, friends, colleagues, and comrades, uh, thank you very much for showing solidarity with Bradford here today. I want to thank Wayman, Shati, and Martin, and each and every individual who has come to show solidarity with Bradford today when we need it most. One thing we must all remember is that together we are stronger. Whether we are black, white, brown, or pink, we are all human beings. And together we must stand against fascism and racism. I'm reminded of um, Pastor Naimola, who said during the Second World War, they came for the communists, and I wasn't a communist, so I said nothing. Then they came for the trade unions, and I wasn't a trade union, so I said nothing. Then they came for the Jews, I wasn't a Jew, so I did nothing. And then one day when they came for me, I looked around and there was no one else to speak for me. That is why it is important for us all to stand united today in Bradford. There are those, there are those in our city, especially in our ci civic leadership, who have scaremongered in our city and said, stay at home. The EDL are coming, stay at home. I wonder if Churchill would have done that when the, when the Nazis were coming to attack Britain in the Second World War. Did Churchill say stay at home? No. Britain made a stand and we won the war and that is exactly what we must do. Every time we are confronted with racists, with uh, uh, bigot, uh, 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 whatever they are, you know, the racists and the fascists and the bigots and we don't want them in our city here. Can I ask each and every comrade who is here today, we hope there will be no trouble at the end. Although Sky TV is running a banner saying there is a riot in Bradford, we must. It, it, that is the kind of media we are faced with. If there is any trouble, we must sit in peace. The police will do a fantastic job, and they are uh, and they are doing a fantastic job in this city. And I want to thank all the police and each and every pr protester, every person who has come here to celebrate our city. Thank you very much. Please, before we go, I would like to say. There is another um, celebration going on in Infirmary Wheels, backed by the council. But we have had a drive around, there's about 50 people there. And they have spent hundreds of thousands of pounds to put that uh, um, um, event on. Before we leave, can we please, we're collecting some money for Pakistan. As you know, there has uh, been a flood. Um, thousands and thousands of people have died. In respect of them, can we please hold a minute silence for all the dead and all the devastation that's been caused to Pakistan. And when we leave, can we please put a pound in the bucket so we send it over there? Can we please have a minute silence for the dead? Ladies and gentlemen, please let's continue to stand against the racists everywhere, wherever they appear in Britain. We must make a stand against them. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, Ash.